explain what your trip at Iowa, your lifestyle, what it has done for you in the last three years that you've been there, or four years? I mean, it changed my life the best way possible. I, wouldn't, I couldn't imagine being anywhere on the planet. Um, I was a place to be, Tom and Terry would do anything for me, and it was awesome. It made me a better person, not just in wrestling, but in life, and if somehow I get a broken leg or, I don't know, a crippled thing and I can't wrestle further on after college, then I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. They prepared me to go out in the working field and be a functioning human. <laughs> it's funny to say, but it's, it's hard um, being a college student and then going, transitioning into that life. Austin, you know what your future is? Um, I still want to compete. Still want to wrestle. Still want to stick around Iowa City. I love it there. Um, if they'll have me, um, but yeah, I love it. Austin, it's been a long time since Exeter Township. Back in the day, you, your career thus far continued to, to get at a higher level. What would you say the biggest transition for you was back in maybe your freshman year of high school to now? What was the biggest change for you and, and how you could progress? Um, I think it changes mental. Um, deal with a lot of things and my uh, back in that people don't see and uh, just working on it day in, day out and uh, becoming who I am today. Last night we interviewed uh, uh, Roman Bravo Young in the uh, room after his match in the semis against you and he said that you are the reason that he was a national champ because he had to work harder every single day knowing that he was going to have to face you again. What is that? When you hear something that, like that, what does it mean? I mean, it's a compliment. Um, I mean, I, I work to be a national champ, and that's what I want to be. I didn't get it done today or yesterday, and I would still have to wrestle fix if I beat RBY, but um, that, that, that's a compliment, and it means a lot. Yeah. Awesome, you know, the human. phrase is to get the next best thing. What's it mean to, you know, battle your way back and, and finish off uh, and get third? And end everything with victory. Yeah, that's, that's something, another mental thing that you learn at Iowa. Um, you can't just give up. Um, there's people in the trenches and there's people working. Um, I mean, you got to get them into that city. you got to. Um, you'll prepare for the rest of your life. Austin, can you imagine where you'd be today if you had not transferred to Iowa? Um, at home. Um, living with my parents and I don't know, playing video games the entire time and being a bum. Austin, what do you hope people remember from your time at Iowa? Um, just how hard I worked and not just in the room but mental side of things and being a good teammate. Was this last ride, you didn't get what you wanted, right? Yep. Did you at least have fun going out there and doing what you did? Stressful. Um, I, don't, I don't know about fun. I mean, yeah, you have fun, but this is the most stressful part of my life. Um, I give everything to it. Um, it's not really fun, but it's, it's, it's interesting. It's interesting how I, how I love the sport. What caused the most stress? You know, I don't want to lose. I want to get it done. I don't want to be a national champ. It's my goal. It's my goal since I was little. Um, and get it. There's a lot of fears, a lot of anxiety, a lot of mental work that goes into it, goes into matches that you don't see. Um, I just want to wrestle the best of my ability, and it's hard. So, yeah. They have a wall in Iowa, four time All Americans. You're going to be on that wall. That's got to mean something pretty special. Um, I, I guess. Um, I would like that asterisk. That asterisk means a lot. That asterisk is big. Uh -huh. That asterisk is big. You see those, and you see the asterisk next to those names, and you see that, and you want to be a part of that. It's a big thing. That asterisk is big. Austin, someday, you won't, have, Austin, someday you won't have all these cameras following you. Would that be better for you? Yeah. Um, no. Let me change that. It, no, it won't because, I mean, this is awesome. Um, I get to test how I public speak, and I get to test how I grow and talk to you guys. So, yeah. Thank you, Austin. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.